Okay, here we have a CAT TH360B telehandler model made by Norscott. Of course, Norscott, you never know what you're going to get whenever you purchase this. This is about circa the 320CL debauchery. Nice job, Norscott. That was that was a great model. Excellent. I didn't, I didn't even think they tried to do any scale drawings on the 320CL. But anyway. Uh, the only reason I brought that up is because whenever I bought this, I bought the 320CL at the same time, not knowing it was going to be so bad, and I threw the 320CL at the wall after I opened it. But anyway, um, something motor art should take notice of is guess what? On this model, you have positionable forks. Look at that. Hey, motor art, look at this. This is like 2003 maybe. You guys are still casting that crap with position forks? Come on, that's ridiculous. Anyway, you can see the decal right there is a little smudged. I don't know how that happened. Overall, this is a pretty cool little model. Uh, my favorite telehandler. The reach is uh, okay. See, it's got cylinders everywhere. These outriggers come down to help support the machine. Right, yeah, like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's not bad. Moving up, you see the three stage boom with a pair of forks. Comes with a bucket, too. I don't have the bucket right now, it's here somewhere. Um, here again, you can see like that. The other side of the model, about the same thing. The wheels are positionable. Excellent. Nice job, Norscott. Not bad. Uh, whenever these first came out, I think they were about 30, 35 bucks maybe. Not bad for what you were getting at the time. Now, if you can even find one, I think they're between 50 and 70. I definitely wouldn't pay it for that. It's a Norscott piece. Um, if you get a chance to get one of these for a reasonable price, I recommend it. It's a great little model. Uh, I am going to try to find a couple more myself. The exhaust stack right there, not much to look at. Some unpainted rivets, but overall they did, a, they did a pretty darn good job on this one. And I'll show it with a load here. I made some one approximately 1 50th scale scaffolding that is due to go on a diorama here soon. And uh, so there's that. little load there bring it down to the ground anyway that's about it for this model thanks for watching and uh, if you like what you see please subscribe and comment thank you